So you are receiving this error on your iMac. No bootable device. Insert boot disk and press any key. Try this quick fix. Hard, uh, turn off the iMac in the back. Okay, it's off now. And when you turn it back on, just hold the option. This is a Windows keyboard, so it's Alt. But Alt and Options will be the same thing and you will come up upon this screen. I have no OS on there, so that's why it's booting up that way. And you just click on here and you'll get the recovery option, which is to, you know, do some work on the disk, um, download the software from Mac, and that's what I'll be doing because um, I deleted the uh, the boot partition and the Mac partition to start. Uh, I'm going to end up giving this Mac away. So I'm starting over and just want to make sure that the hard drive is completely wiped before I give it away. You will get this screen. And on this screen, you have different options. And the way you connect to the Wi-Fi is you go on the top right and uh, click right at the corner right there and you will see the Wi-Fi's come up. It's a different one, so let's do that. Let's connect to a Wi-Fi because you, you'll either need a physical ethernet connection or connecting to the Wi-Fi to re-download the software. So now I'm just gonna reinstall the Mac OS. I'll copy time. This is an old Mac. It's going to be used just for surfing the web, pretty much. And I'm going to be using the Macintosh partition. And I'm going to have to now log in. Let me do that. So now, as you see, it's downloading the software, reinstalling it, and that's it. And um, it should take, uh, that, it's saying 12 minutes. Let's see how long it takes. Well, I'm, I'm sorry, I won't be waiting, but uh, I'm ending the video here. Uh, but it, it's not going to take long, maybe half an hour, for every, half an hour to an hour to get everything in there. Um, installed, downloaded and installed. All right, I hope this really helps. Thank you for watching. Bye.